All right, welcome back to the Far Outpost. A couple different things. We got a uh, Facebook Marketplace find, 100 kilograms of Ivanko old school chromes. They stopped making these in 2012. Um, one of them is pretty rough. As you can see, we're gonna try to see if we can refinish this, but it's missing a lot of chrome on it. So I'm not sure if I can. This one actually is a little better. That one I might just polish up the chrome and then uh, just repaint the green section. It looks, you can see there's two different shades of green in there. So I think it's already been refinished once. So we'll have to try to sand that all the way down this time and then give it a good primer and, and pick one color of green. I've reached out to Ivanko about the paint code. Have not heard back. If anyone has that wants to drop it in the comments, go ahead. But other than that, I'll just pick a, uh, a good metal green um, that I like at the, you know, at the Home Depot or the Lowe's. So, but that's not what we're here for. What we're here for is the first batch of Rogue accessories for the new uh, Rogue Monster 6 is in. They sent us the trolley arms today, as well as the actual sliders or latches. So when you, board, when you order something from Rogue, you get obviously quality, American Steel, American Jobs. This is the sign-off sheets they go through and QA every piece. Um, this stuff is just feels fantastic, the knurling on this, even though you're not going to lift with this, obviously. The knurling is, is awesome. Nothing but high quality. Super easy to use. Um, just the best stuff. One-inch hardware everywhere. One of the things I thought was really cool was this. This new system that they have here has knurled handles when you're when you're undoing a bolt. So it's not, um, it's just a screw on bolt, but it's got knurling. I mean, that's just taking it to the next level. Awesome. And then this is what it looks like boxed up. So packed really super well. Um, delivery times right now are pretty, pretty slow. They're like a 14 to 21 day delay after you order it. And then another couple days to get it to you. This stuff shipped out, I think Thursday at Saturday morning. So it only took two days to get to Colorado from Ohio, but we placed the order April 3rd. And it is now April 18th, so about, about 12 days to get it pulled from the warehouse and onto a UPS truck and then another three days to get it to us. But super happy when this whole gym is put together, we'll cut another gym review. Uh, have a great day out there, everybody.